Hello, Split Coast friends. I'm Franz Martin, independent demonstrator with Stamping Up at FrenchyStamps.com. Today, I'm going to share with you the thumping, not the thumping, but the Q-tips technique. Uh, really, it's Q-tips and thumping. Uh, very simple. What you're going to do is take uh, about five, you can do more or less, of Q-tips. And I just tied them up together with an elastic here. Then you're going to take a few colors. In this choice, I'm choosing pumpkin pie, crushed curry, and very little of whole olive. You're going to take a clear block, or you can use wax paper. You're going to put a few drops. I did a few drops of pumpkin pie. I'm going to come with my cherry cobbler and do a few drops. And then for the whole olive, I'm going to just do one little drop on the side. I just want very little of the green. Now what I've done, I pre-stamped, speed up the process here, I pre-stamped the trees from Winterwood. Stamp that with Memento Black Ink and I sponge Balmy Blue at the top and Old Olive at the bottom. So whatever you prefer. This was the same one. This was, was, was with the Sheltering Tree. And also I did um, one with a peaceful, um, peaceful place here. So it doesn't matter the trees, like the skeleton tree work even better with that. You're going to take your, this is, oh, here we go. going to take the new one there. going to remove that. And I had started here and the battery went down. So live and learn. I'm going to tap here, tap on the side. You want to make sure that your Q-tips are about equally. And I'm going to come and just tap. So it's going to give you the look of the trees there. You can use as many colors as you want. It's just be careful not to use uh, like um, too many of the colors that when they're going to tap together it's going to get mixed right so if you use a lot of red then all your yellow would become red I need more yellow so I'm going to come here and tap 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 also what you can do to make it more fallish you can add some that fell down here little leaves that fell down here we go now I'm going to add maybe a bit there. Now I'm going to come, like I said, the green, I just wanted very little. I'm going on the side there, like this. And I'm going to add just a few leaves that didn't turn yet. That is it on the Q-tips technique. Now, to finish the card, I use eight and a half by five and a half score at four and a quarter crush curry I'm going to mount uh, my already uh, finished stamping and uh, the q-tips technique I'm going to mount that on crush uh, not crush but Cajun crates this one was measuring five by three and a quarter my Cajun craze measure five and a quarter by four now, if you notice the circle, that is a one and three quarter that I die cut from the center of that for my greeting. My greeting is from the stamp set Gather Together. So we're going to attach, well, before that I attach that, I'm using the baker's twine there, the linen uh, twine that is crush curry. So any linen uh, twine or whatever you want to decorate it and I just did loop around put that in the back gonna start and I crisscross it 
and then here and then in the center and <coughs> excuse me my uh, when it gathered together in the center there it's not at the place that I want but let me share with you how we're going to fix that. I'm going to place that right here. Now we're going to attach that to our card front. Oops, here we go. Now I'm all cock high here. Let's attach this over here. Now for the greeting, like I said, I, I, didn't, I don't want that there. So I'm going to use a dimensional, or yeah, dimensional going to work here. And I'm going to bring that where I want it. I want this about here. So see, you just gather that where you want it. going to put my dimensional on top of that here we go I'm going to remove this and then I'm going to add two more dimensional just for luck here one over there just so my circles stay very lovely raised up and we're going to put our grating at the top season of things. Et voilà my friend, that's simple. So um, all the uh, written directions are going to be right there on Split Coast. And thank you so much for watching. And Split Coast, thank you for inviting me to be your tutorial guest. Have a lovely day my friend. Bye bye for now.